Teacher talking sports, what it does, what it do, how we live. And after week two, the Raiders were really feeling good about themselves with a huge upset win comeback over the Baltimore Ravens, 26-23, evening their record to 1-1. One one. Their week three game was against the Carolina Panthers, who... I had looked by far as the worst team in the NFL the first two weeks of the season. Of course, they made a quarterback change to Andy Dalton. But he became the first player this season that threw for 300 yards and three touchdowns in a game. And the Panthers uh, really beat up on the Las Vegas Raiders. And speaking of beat up, that's how the Raiders uh, injury report makes them Seem like as a team, uh, we know they will be without Max Crosby today against the Cleveland Browns. They will also be without wide receiver Devontae Adams. The problem is it might not just be this game. Devontae Adams considered week to week. Adam Schefter, ESPN. He, uh, Adams pulled up lame in the closing minutes of the Las Vegas Raiders practice Thursday, grabbing his hamstring with an injury that was expected to sideline. The star wide receiver on a week to week basis, uh, they uh, they quickly put considered him out for Sunday's game after he came up limp. Uh, mentions how Crosby has a high left ankle sprain, so he will be out for week four. Uh, they are playing the Cleveland Browns, uh, so you know if Deshaun Watson can't beat the Raiders without Devontae and Max Crosby. Oh, man, I would not want to be him and listening to all the noise. I mean, of course, already he, he already hears a lot of noise. But, man, Browns fans are going to be all in on wanting Jameis Winston in the game. But uh, we know last week they took out Gardner Minshew, inserted Aiden O'Connell. But um, head coach Antonio Pierce announced that Gardner Minshew will still be the starting quarterback we see Adams was tied for the team league in receptions, led the team in receiving yards, one of four guys with one receiving touchdown on the season. That will probably bring a lot more attention to Brock Bowers, uh, who has looked awesome thus far in his first three career NFL games. Otherwise, you got Jacoby Myers, and now Trey Tucker will be that wide receiver too. The only other wide receiver with a catch is DJ Turner, who has won on the season. Man, um, I'm a little bit bothered by it because I have Devontae Adams on my fantasy team. I'm 2-1, and one, uh, and my wide receiver play hasn't been great. Um, I have Alave, who is expected to play. He's questionable. I have McLaren, who struggled his first two games, but had 100 yards and a touchdown in week three. And replacing Adams, i leaning towards Michael Wilson, who I picked up um, over... Who's my other guy? Jerry Judy. Uh, you know, I just can't trust a wide receiver, too, with Deshaun Watson. Uh, if I had known Adams would have gotten hurt, was going to get hurt, I might have started Wandale Robinson, who's also on my bench, but he played Thursday night and had 11 receptions. But anyhow, enough about my fantasy team. Um, Gardner Minshew, without his top target, already on thin ice. Uh, his starting job is in peril um will we be seeing Aiden O'Connell soon and you know who do who wins today I mean it's kind of a big game for both teams Raiders and Browns both one and two if they have any playoff aspirations anyhow don't forget to subscribe tell a friend tell a friend tell a friend to subscribe like the video share the video hit the bell for notifications I'm out